Hello and welcome to another video. Today we'll be talking about how to correctly upload your videos from your mobile phone that will give you more exposure on your channel, ultimately to get more views and subscribers. So if you're new here, please consider subscribing and let's get on with the video. Now to upload your videos from your mobile, you need two apps. One is a main YouTube app that you can download from Play Store. Another is YouTube Studio. This method should work equally on iPhone and Android with a little bit of differences between them. Today I'll be using Android device and I'll take you to my mobile screen now. Now I presume you have uh, both apps up and running. You've downloaded uh, YouTube Studio as well. So to upload our video, we go to the main uh, YouTube app and remember to select the correct channel from the uh, top right corner. Uh, is for people who have uh, more than one channel. Now, to option there to upload your video. Now you click on uh, this uh, plus sign in the middle and you see you have uh, two options there, upload a video and go live. Some of you may have uh, more than one option such as um, create a short, create a post and add to your story. It depends uh, on your monetization level. So we click on uh, upload a video. So once you click on upload a video you can select a video from your gallery that you want to upload and if you see here you have few options down there now once your video is ready to upload you be asked to enter the title so we can enter the random title there so now we've got the title there and after this you have four main options uh, one is uh, to add description so we've entered uh, our description there. Now, second option here is to have your video public, means your video is gonna be online instantly and people should be able to watch uh, that uh, video. Second option is unlisted. Unlisted means your video is not public, however, you can share your video with a link. This option helps if uh, you want someone to review your contents for any suggestions before it goes public. Now, third option is private. Private means no one has access to the video, not even with the link, except the people you choose by an email address. And the last option is schedule. Now, let's say if you are um, traveling on the day you normally release or publish your video and you won't have time to add it you won't have time to publish the video you might not get to the network uh, when you're traveling so simply select here and you can select uh, the date now the next option is asking you to select the type of the content you are going to post such as uh, yes it's made for kids or no it's not made for kids now this is because some time back a law came into force to protect kids from certain contents and that law called COPPA as you can read uh, from uh, this screen here. If you select an option that says it's made for kids such as contents related to kids such as cartoons or nursery rhymes remember the reach for these kind of contents will be limited. Your uh, monetization will be affected as less as will be played on these uh, kind of uh, videos another option here you see is age restriction now let's say you have uh, an adult humor content which is only suitable for adults then you select this so only people who are 18 and over can um, access to the content so what i'm going to do is for now i'm going to select no for both uh, of these options and what we did is after getting that video uh, just click uh, the upload button or save on the top right hand corner and go to your YouTube studio. Now once you're in YouTube studio click on videos and you have that video coming up that you just uh, uploaded from main YouTube app. So if you want to make some changes in this video there are three options there on the top. First one is to view this video in YouTube app second is to share this video and the third one is to edit the video so I'm going to click on edit once you click on edit you see a few options there that you can 
also added the thumbnail so select the thumbnail that is already generated by youtube or you can upload your own custom thumbnail by clicking this uh, custom thumbnail button and after that you go to add to playlist try to save uh, your video in relevant playlist and now i'm going to talk about uh, adding tags if you see here the last option here that is to add tags now if you want to know um, how to add tags or if you want to know the easiest way to add tags you can simply uh, watch the video that I'm going to link on the top of this uh, video press save but just to explain you briefly if you want to add tags manually you can add tags let's say how to fix your Android phone and what you need to do is add comma here and this is how you add tags in your video for each tag you need to enter comma in the end so press save now if you want to uh, make further changes in your video um, you can also do that by selecting advanced settings so click that now if you see here the next uh, option you have here is uh, to add the category of your video such as gaming education entertainment film and animation how to and style music news and politics so what you need to do is select the correct category for your video where you think that video is best suitable and now here um, the next option is asking you to um, select the type of license you want so when you click there in this uh, in this drop down menu you see two options there standard youtube license and creative common standard youtube license means you have the copyrights for your video and no one can use your contents second option is creative common where um, people can reuse your contents for their projects next option you see here uh, if you want to allow comments on your videos you can just uh, select that or you can turn the comments off and if you want other people to see the rating means dislikes and likes of your videos uh, you can simply leave this on or turn it off the next option you see is allow embedding so this option is if you want people to embed um, your video in their websites uh, with html code and you simply press save there you go guys now your video is um, all ready to go live which you can do by changing it from unlisted to public or scheduled to public so if we click there and uh, the video is scheduled here so you can select public now um, and it will change to public it will just go live instantly that's it guys hope you have slightly better understanding about the options you have when uploading a video and now you can upload your videos correctly to get more views and better exposure take care stay safe stay blessed thank you